What's going on, Glock? I figured I'd try to give you some help on this particular Acer issue um, with Ubuntu you're having. Um, I had an Acer Extensa 4420 that I had a lot of issues trying to get Ubuntu installed. I did my MD5 checks. I did trying to burn at slower write speeds. Um, I tried the x86 install CD um, and I tried the AMD 64 install CD with it being an AMD system. Problem ended up being Ubiquity. Now Ubiquity is actually the program that is the installer for Ubuntu. Um, you get a lot of errors with Ubiquity um, sometimes. You know, it could be it could be something as simple as um, just the conflict in hardware. Um, you know. Linux still does have some issues um, with hardware, um, but for the most part, the installs are fairly simple. Um, what you want to do is go to Ubuntu.com and look for the alternative install CDs. Basically, these are the text-based install CDs that if you've repartitioned Windows XP at all, you should be fairly familiar with if you can reinstall Windows XP, you can reinstall, you can install Ubuntu through the text system too. Um, you know, uh, some of the other issues people will tell you is, um, I noticed you're running, I believe, Intrepid, upgrade to 9.04 instead, um, try double checking your MD5s, um, you know, if you're running x86, we're running x86. If you're running an AMD system, we want the 64, AMD 64 CD instead. Um, because I know on my install, I was getting a lot of errors telling me that maybe my hard drive was faulty or my CD drive was faulty. Um, that was a brand new computer that I bought, so I knew that wasn't quite right. But you know, maybe that'll help. I hope, man. Um, let me know. Um, figure I'd give you some help on my experience with Ubuntu and Acer's. Um, so it's probably Ubiquity or the installer that's the issue. So use the text-based install CD instead.